What's going on, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls? I am back. Just wanted to go over a purchase I had made, a big cologne purchase that I had made. So I buy all my cologne on eBay. Is it safe to buy cologne on eBay? Yes. Can you buy cologne on eBay? Yes. Do you have to be careful buying cologne on eBay? Yes. So you have to pay attention to the reviews. You have to pay attention to who you're buying from, right? If a seller has 10 sales, even if they're hundred percent feedback, I'm not buying cologne from that person. It's just not happening. You know, if you get something fake, you get ripped off. You got to play the game with eBay. Uh, to get, you know, to get your money back and my motto, you know, I work hard for my money once. I don't want to work hard for it twice. So came in two boxes. So there's a difference, right? So tester boxes. I received two of those today. Completely fine. It's the same cologne. Doesn't matter, right? It's what they set out on the table for you to smell at Macy's, etc. These are the same cologne. Other colognes come in their boxes. Here's my Prada box. Oh, the one came, okay. And then here are my Dolce & Gabbana boxes. I have uh, bottles of these already. I just wanted to order more. These are the 6.7 ounces. I got these for 60 bucks each. So light blue, pour home, I hope if I said that correctly. I mean, they even have the stamps on them. So everything I order is from the same person. Uh, actually, I have two guys that I order through uh, companies that I order through on eBay. And I've never had a single issue. Um, when I started, I, I went and, you know, compared them, took pictures and, you know, looked at the bottle very carefully and went into Macy's to, you know, it's nice to have them there for that. The markup's too crazy. I'm not paying it. Um, so this order, just this stuff. Right here. Cost me 300 and... What's 258 plus one? So it was about 370 for all these bottles. We're talking 700 plus easy at Macy's. This bottle alone is almost $200. I paid 76. Um, I paid 40 for the Intenso. Uh, Dolce Cabana, the one, this right here, guys, this is my first bottle of this. You gotta get it, you gotta have it. This is incredible. The Prada's really nice. Um, the Intenso's okay, it, it smells just like the Pour Home. Um, but Dolce Cabana, the one, it's the one. You gotta have it. This smells incredible. I'm gonna order another bottle of this. They actually sent me a 25% off for the next uh, uh, order. So Forever Lux is one of the companies that I use on eBay. Um, I'll post the other one in, in the description. But uh, the light blue bottle, 60 bucks for the 6.7. Like, come on. That's a $140 bottle, $120 at Macy's. So we're talking half off. This is my favorite cologne. This is my second bottle. I've got another one in my cabinet. It's probably all together. I have about 30 bottles of, of cologne and they're all high end. Um, but Azaro wanted by night. It's, it's like a candyish smell. It's phenomenal. If you don't have this, you got to have it. These two right here, Dolce Cabana, the one, Azaro wanted by night. It, they're must-haves. I wanted the Prada just because I've never had it. And I made some really good money on Marketplace uh, this week and last week. So I wanted to buy some stuff for myself. So this is a must-have as well. I like having the Dolce's. I don't know why I bought another poor home. I never wear it. It's a really strong smell. Um, it's really popular, don't get me wrong, but the light blue I feel is much better. Uh, the Intenso, I won't order again. Um, I just wanted to have it. It was only 40 bucks, 100 something uh, retail, easily. This one I believe was 60 and I know, and this is the, um, 
3.3 ounce bottle. I know this runs well into the $100 range at Macy's. So really good buy. Uh, everything here was about half off and they're all brand new authentic. You know, again, you know, here's the Prada bottle or box. 3.3 ounce. This is the Luna Rasa, uh, if I'm saying that correctly. This is one that I really wanted, so I made sure I got it. Um, I won't use it so much because this is one of the more expensive ones. You know, 70 something dollars on eBay from, uh, you know, the, the company that I order through. Uh, you go into the store, you're going to see almost a $200 price tag. So, you know, in these boxes, they, they do come sealed, you know, in the plastic. I know they're authentic. I don't even have to look anymore. Um, I do still pay attention, but again, just keep in mind, guys, the tester boxes don't matter. They're, they're the same thing. You know, I hear it a lot. People are like, oh, it's a, it's a tester box. It's not the same cologne. It's the same cologne. It's the same exact cologne. Um, I don't really care about the box. I'm not keeping it in my cabinet, so it doesn't matter to me, but yeah, so, so, so yes, you can order cologne on eBay. I would recommend it 100%, but again, just be very careful. Do your due diligence. Make sure that you're paying attention. Same thing with Marketplace, right? If you're going to go buy something from somebody, don't go buy something from someone that doesn't have a picture, doesn't have reviews, because what are you doing? You're setting yourself up for failure, right? You want to make sure that you do your due diligence, you pay attention to, you know, who's bought from them before, you know, if they have mutual friends, if their Facebook page, and I'm sorry to go off on a tangent here on Marketplace, but for everyone's protection, just for a little bit of knowledge, in case you're new to this game, don't go to a profile and go meet somebody who just created their profile in 2024, right? That has zero friends, uh, uh, no picture of themselves or no pictures. And if they have uh, posts on their account, if you, you know, scan through their account, make sure they have likes and comments, right? If they post 10 pictures and none of them have any likes, are you going to meet this person? No. Same thing with eBay. If you go onto a page and they don't have any likes or any comments or anything like that, don't buy from them. Dixie, say hi. You want to make sure everything you do that person's reviewed. So, you know, for me, making this purchase completely safe, half price, if not more than half price. So, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. I'm trying to get myself a new spot here. I'm actually gonna make the back room into a new spot uh, where I'll do all my videos, kind of make it a little bit more professional. Um, but these came in two boxes. Same shipper, not sure why. Ordered all this from one person. Again, I'll put that person in, in the description. Um, like, subscribe. Guys, thank you. Hope you enjoyed the video. I'll talk to you soon.